Hey everybody, Noble here. Curious George, the Mandela Effect. Did Curious George have a tail? And I thought, of course Curious George had a tail. All monkeys have tails. And uh, I used to listen to Curious George and, and watch him all the time when I was young. But I wasn't 100% sure. You know, I was pretty damn sure, but not 100%. And so, rooting through the archives, I came up with this, which is a little record that I used to listen to when I was a kid. And it's actually like a mini 33. And when I used to listen to the record, I would look at the pictures. And so, I looked at the back of this little uh, record setup the sleeve of the record quite a bit with the pictures on it. Uh, the record's about 15 minutes long in total. And and I would gawk at this and listen to the story. And, you know, on the back here, of course, we have Curious George with no tail now. <laughs> and another picture of Curious George painting himself with no tail and no tail. And then I seen this picture. And I remembered, you know, I, I remember 100% for sure now. This is Curious George at his job as a window washer. And he used to carry this water pail with his tail. Not even kidding. Um, not only with the picture do I remember 100%. But with the audio as well, of course, I went ahead and, and listened to this and nowhere on it does it mention his tail. Uh, but I did find a spot that uh, I'll show you here in a minute that totally made me remember like 100% for sure. Um, but on this here, it shows him, you know, with a, a water jug or, you know, a water bucket for cleaning the windows and the string does this weird curvy thing and you know like I don't know how he's supposed to really reach this bucket he has a little loop on the back of his belt I guess now for uh, for holding the string which it doesn't show on this picture but yeah I remember for sure Curious George used to hold this bucket with his tail and I really remembered for sure when I started listening to this. I'll play just a little piece for you here. The Cookums was a kind man, and did not so much. But George had to clean up the kitchen and then do all the dishes. My, what a lot of them there were. The Cookums was watching George. You were lucky to have four hands in it. You can, you can do things twice as quickly. I, I have, have a friend who could use a handy little fellow like you to wash windows. George was ready to start. start. My, my, how, how many windows there were. But George got ahead him. Since, since he worked with all four hands, he jumped, he jumped from window to window. window. Just, just as he had once jumped from tree to tree in the African jungle. <laughs> With four hands. And I used to sit there as a kid and go, No, he has five! He has five! <laughs> I'm not even kidding you. I totally remember doing that because I would sit there and look at this picture. Now, clearly, George never had five hands. But he was able to do the window cleaning job much better because he could carry the bucket with his tail. I remember sitting there thinking, no, five, five. <laughs> Obviously, like I said, it wasn't uh, five hands that he had. But that audio, you know, clearly rem makes me remember 100%. And along with this picture, in combination with it, that he had a tail. In fact, he had a tail on this damn picture. <laughs> now he doesn't. But there it is, Mr. Curious George with no tail, but I guess he's getting along all right without it in this case. Looks like Colonel Sanders here trying to stuff some mashed potatoes in the kid's face. <laughs> but yeah, there it is, guys. 
I'm not a big fan of the product and entertainment stuff, but if I come up with something, I'd like to like to show you. And uh, yeah, there's a take from my, one of my previous videos, one I love so much. <clears throat> this is a picture from a video I found. This kid found this this Sex in the City container or tube of I don't know if it's like a, a body soap or shampoo or what or gel. <clears throat> I'll leave a link in the comments. And I thought I'd show you this one too. It ain't too much, but Florida looks really long here to me. This was from Sleeping in Seattle movie. But anyhow, guys. To George. Peace out.